This mini quilt collection calls attention to the different sectors of climate solutions as defined by Project Drawdown. In order to reduce greenhouse gas concentrations, there are areas of action that involve reducing emissions, sequestering existing carbon dioxide from the atmosphere, while at the same time ensuring rights and fostering equality in global social systems. Each quilt calls attention to the portfolio of drawdown sectors, with the fabrics highlighting various solutions within each sector. This quilt uses fabric to represent each of the nine project drawdown sectors, shown together to emphasize how these solutions and additional ones still being researched are necessary to reverse the increase of greenhouse gases in the atmosphere. The drawdown sector electricity seeks to investigate how we can generate electricity for the whole world without burning fossil fuels, and how the means of transmitting, storing, and using electricity needs to evolve. Solutions in this sector focus on enhancing efficiency to reduce the demand for electricity generation, shifting production away from fossil fuels, and improving the system to balance supply with demand. The fabrics in this quilt highlight different solutions in the electricity sector, including solar power, microgrids, wind turbines, geothermal power, and ocean power. This quilt, along with the other quilts for the Project Drawdown sectors under Sources, are bordered in red. The Drawdown sector Food, Agriculture, and Land Use explores the questions, how can we reduce the pressures on ecosystems and land while meeting the growing demands for food and fiber worldwide? And how can we do what we do on land better, tending it in ways that decrease emissions from agriculture and forestry? The solutions in this sector address food waste and diets, protecting land and ecosystems, and shifting agricultural practices to ones that lower emissions. The fabrics in this quilt highlight solutions such as plant-rich diets, the two solutions connected to rice production and intensification, and solutions relating to improved farming practices. The drawdown sector for industry seeks to improve production of industrial processes and materials, and researches how to make use of waste and move towards flows of substances that are efficient and circular. These solutions focus on improving materials reclaiming waste as a resource, addressing chemical refrigerants, and enhancing efficiency. The fabrics in this quilt represent the solutions for recycling, composting, with the backing fabric calling attention to alternative cement. The drawdown sector for transportation researches how we can support the social good of mobility while ending the dependence on petroleum, and how vehicles, infrastructure, and operations need to change to eliminate transportation emissions. Transportation needs to shift to alternative modes, enhance efficiency, and move towards the electrification of vehicles. The fabrics in this quilt represent the solutions of efficient ocean shipping, efficient aviation, electric trains and high-speed rails, and efforts connected to cars and bicycles. With buildings using more than half of all electricity, the drawdown sector for buildings explores how we can retrofit existing buildings and create new buildings to minimize energy use, in addition to how we can stop other on-site sources of emissions. Building solutions focus on enhancing efficiency on new construction, as well as retrofitting existing structures, shifting to clean energy sources, and addressing refrigerants. A collection of fabrics with various building prints on the front and back highlight the building sector. As land sinks currently return 26% of human-caused emissions to Earth, how can work in this sector sequester more carbon in biomass and soil, as well as support and enhance natural processes, including the capacity of land to renew? Solutions in the land sink sector focus on addressing food waste and plant-rich diets, protecting and restoring ecosystems, shifting agricultural practices, and reviving degraded land. The quilt fabrics focus on the perennial stable crops solutions, such as bananas, avocado, and coconut. 
that have higher rates of carbon sequestration compared to annual crops, and the solution on bamboo production. The fabric backing calls attention to temperate and tropical forest restoration. This quilt, along with the other quilts for the project drawdown sectors under sinks, are bordered in purple. As coastal and ocean sinks bring 17% of all heat trapping emissions back to Earth, what practices can be used to sequester carbon in coastal, marine, and open ocean environments? And how can human activity support and enhance natural processes? Solutions involving the coast and ocean integrate protection and restoration of ecosystems and a shift in agricultural practices, which yield additional benefits such as storm protection and healthy fisheries. The quilt fabrics focus on the current solutions that highlight mangrove forests, salt marshes, and seagrass. At this time, Project Drawdown has assessed few solutions for engineered sinks but biochar production is one of the engineered solutions. Biochar is commonly made from waste material, ranging from peanut shells to rice straw to wood scraps, all featured in the fabrics of this quilt. Project Drawdown's mission focuses on drawing down levels of atmospheric gases as quickly, safely, and equitably as possible. As climate and social systems are interconnected, Drawdown explores how efforts in educating girls and family planning benefits the planet. This quilt utilizes fabric that highlights health and education, with one fabric panel dedicated to girls in STEM. The back of the quilt continues the theme with children on swings and pencils. This quilt for the Project Drawdown sector under society is bordered in yellow. This collection of mini quilts highlights various approaches to reducing our greenhouse gas emissions as defined by Project Drawdown. The quilts reflect the need to combine our efforts in reducing emissions while sequestering existing carbon dioxide from the atmosphere and at the same time ensuring rights for equity and access. To learn more about climate solutions and what actions you can take, please visit drawdown.org.